In this video, you'll learn how to add a webhook destination and trigger a notification from the workflow. Destinations are the data outputs that will receive streamlined, correlated, enhanced incidents after they've processed in New Relic AI. Destinations are used to send the relevant data to the relevant person or team. In this demo, we will be creating a customized webhook destination via workflows that will sync incident intelligent issues with webhook incidents. In order to add the webhook destination, go to the destination page and click on webhook. As a high-level overview, in order to add the destination, you'll need a unique destination name, a webhook URL, and if you'd like, you can choose to add an authorization. Once on the on-screen steps are completed, proceed to the workflow module under Enrich and Notify, which can be found on the left navigation menu in New Relic Apply Intelligence. With workflows, you control when and where you want to receive notifications about issues, tunnel the right information to the relevant person or team, and enrich your issues notifications with additional New Relic data. Start by clicking Add a Workflow on the right-hand corner. Now give your workflow a meaningful title. Next, filter out what issues you would like to notify. In this example, I'll set the priority to critical so that I only receive critical issues. In addition, you have the option to add enrichments. Enrichments can give additional context on alert notifications by adding NRQL query results to them. In this example, I'll add a basic query to get the average CPU utilization. For more information on enrichments, please refer to our documentation page. The final addition is the notify section, where you can find your pre-configured destination. In this example, we'll choose webhook. It should be noted that you can also create a new destination from here. Once you select your destination, you will see a pre-populated template payload with suggested attributes, and this can be custom to your own needs. You can use the default payload or customize it to contain the required data using handlebar syntax. If you visit our documentation page, you can also pick variables from the variables menu and apply handlebar syntax to enrich your webhook. It's important to note that the request content type is JSON by default. Hence, the payload needs to keep the JSON form. The preview section on the right-hand side shows an expected payload after the template is rendered. Once you customize your notifications message, you can send a test notification. This will create an incident in webhook. Now simply click Update Message. You can test the entire workflow, which will look for a real issue that matches your condition and the information on all defined notifier destinations. Once finished setting up the workflow, simply click Activate Workflow. Congratulations! You've set up your webhook destination and created a workflow. For further tutorials on destinations or workflows, visit our docs page under New Relic Applied Intelligence. Thank you.